inside my own world of make-believe Kids okay. in the cradle's profanities I see the through ice covered in pink and bleach Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watch me weep I love everything Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe But that's alright oh, Only one player left alive and 8-bit getting dismounted Finally Ted does take down that rogue player from Team RG This will give a little bit of time Four team expert to recuperate. Karatosh moving forward to pick up a waste. Very important they have the members as they go against this enemy team. Ash has absolutely no hope of being get up here. All the circles moving towards x -Park as well on the next shift. It is heavily northern. It's difficult to see, but I've got a little map up here. I can tell you it's going to move their way. Ash going down and 8-Bit's reign of terror seems to be coming to a close. Team x -Park now, the arbiters of death. They have a really good position. Sure, the vehicle might have proved a little bit of disadvantage earlier, but now it's really, really good for them, providing them so much cover. Oh, look at Lovely that. Lovely nade over the top. Goes on to Avi. That was basically, the spray was right on top of him. Karatosh almost got them. Mega Stars, though, looking really worse for wear now. Only one player is the final boss of the game. Ronak moving forward, just jumping around, trying to bait out the shots from Final Boss. Out they come right now. Ronak will go down. Final Boss still going. Looking for the flush onto him. Scout coming around the side. Will they be able to finish oh, it? Yeah. Yes, they will. x -Park, the first winners of match one today. Able to pick up a total of, I think that's 12 kills coming in for them. A little bit of quick, yeah, 12 kills. For, for a chicken dinner, fantastic showing, but Mega Stars as well. They were able to pick up 10 in a second fight with Manu. It will Scout be able to pick up the pieces? That's the question as the blue is pushing them yeah. as well. Manu said, Retribution, Ooh. nice spot on the top of this hill right now. They're getting in the knock on there with a Molotov. Really so many other teams. There's the smoke, providing the cover to 8-bit below. Scout getting in the knock on there with a Molotov. Really, really well done. And then hits onto Manu as well to flush him. Blind is now out in ninth. Only eight teams remaining in phase seven as well. Scout just still going, turning around and shooting over onto Payne as well. He's he's controlling the northern side just all on his lonesome. Cobalt Managed down. to get uh, Team KO as well. They are out of the running as Scout now opens a little bit more ground for him to try and push in. Obviously, the big boys here, Retribution and Mega Rex with four members remaining. 8-bit with two, Hype with two as well. And then we just go down from there. Team RG out there in the smoke. Next circle as well is going to go back to Retribution. Still being able to control it. A nice wall for them to play in a mountainside as well. 8-bit just cowering in the shadows. Scout going to have a really tough time moving in here. He's he has to move through hype cover, as well, though, before he can even get to Retribution. Mega X Uncaught just hit the side there, wow. but it's Scout who takes him down. Will go for that kill there. He has cover from Pain as well. That little ridge side providing him so, so much protection from all the teams up here on the compound, so he could easily go for that kill. But now Mega X will absolutely know where he is if they choose to make that crash into the walls. The question is, have they been tracking the number of kills going over onto Xbox? Have they no do they know that there's only one player left alive for them? Because if they don't, they might come a cropper. But oh, a little bit of a fight with Cold Blood as Scout now engaged in another fray and comes out on top once more. Nice this guy life. is a machine, a one-man army in Xbox. You can see why they're sat at the top. This guy is on fire. Just knocks Payne out of the running. Scout still going. In comes the next. Oh my God! Huge one spray out. coming from Scout. Does he live? No. no. Paradox and Swag so, so low there. Despite going down, I think he's pretty much put the nail in the coffin for Mega Rex right now. That's a lot of damage sent their way, but they do find the similar bunker that One it was threat from them. They'll be no longer boxed in. Retribution putting the work onto Team KO after Team KO basically given a lot of harassment to a lot of the teams surrounding them. This rotation from Xbox actually is really, really good. They now have oh the central God. zone. They have the position against everybody who wants to push in. And remember, Pain Team can't push out shots. Team Xbox right on top of Team KO looking for the knockout on them. They are going to be pushing down towards the hill as well. And it looks like it's going to go well for them. I think that's Team KO eliminated. Xbox wipe the hillside. 8-Bit looking to go for that loot crate though. Yeah, Nepali. Well, yeah, I mean, sad yeah, way to go out. Fair enough, but in comes the total scoreboard.
couple of teams still holding out, but look at that, Orange Rock still in fourth place. That is absolutely insane. They are currently sat 55 points beneath the current leader, x uh, who, which is quite obviously a very achievable scoreline for them mm. in a single day. Yeah. So we'll be looking out for them tomorrow. Make sure you do tune in then. Zone page after eight games. As we move over to our kills leaderboard, 21 kills for Scout. It's Mega X and it's X Spark as well, just filling out this board at the moment. Mm. Huge numbers of kills starting to rack up, of course, now. Uh, eight maps played, so we're looking to break those 20 kill points. Yeah, Scout doing a really good job with 21 total. Paradox there, really, really strong fragger from Mega X. Can anybody out there hear me?